Okay, so here's my brother Aaron who came to visit and help. <clears throat> um, working on this process that we've been doing to install each stud. So he'll walk around. He just clamped it there. He'll walk around and clamp. Sorry about the sun. That stud. I'll also screw it down if you can see that. I just wanted to show you that. Alright, so we had all these studs installed already, but I just wanted to show the uh, process that we've been doing since I haven't been able to detail the process on any of the other studs. Basically, I showed this product before. It's great. Um, it specifically says that it'll adhere to all of the surfaces that I'm using. And then you just want to put a healthy bead and little globs of it is okay because if it pushes out the edge that just means you did a good job and uh, you can get rid of the excess when it pushes out like that. This was a little light so I'll do a little more here. That's probably more than enough. <clears throat> okay, so I can set that down. And you can see I've got these two pieces of angle hardware installed on the board. And this is where this piece goes. I've actually drilled my holes out as you should. flat spot. The board will go right here in this corner. Nice flush fit. And then I'll screw those in, making sure that uh, this stays flush to the surfaces I want it flush to, which is basically my joist and this surface right here. Because the aluminum I can press up against it later. So. It looks beautiful, and I'm going to screw it in. Thanks. Okay, and lastly, I didn't mention this, but you always want to clamp it. <clears throat> if you're using a construction adhesive, or usually when you're using adhesive, if you can, clamp it. So you can see it's squeezing out that joint right there. It'll be a nice fit. And no other glue seems to be coming out. We're screwed in. We're flush to our wall. So I'm satisfied. Sweet. So I should have had it like that, I think. Okay. As you can see, here's more clamping. This stud just went in. There's some pretty awesome clamps, I must say. Yep, yeah, that's that. Those also have the angle hardware. Sweet. What we're working on now is cutting foam for these spaces in our new, in between our new studs. So uh, <clears throat> we'll go through that with you real quick. Just wanted to say, if you have to take these apart, my brother just showed me. It's real self-explanatory to get it back in. You just there's the whites. You can see it says right there. Sorry, one sec. Right there it says white. Um, put the white wire in there, clamp it down, and over here is black, so, you know, same with the black wire, clamp it down, and then the one that looks like a hook is the ground, and do it into there. For anybody that didn't know how to do that, we had to take this one apart because, uh, the cap, the plastic cap was cracked, so I'm going to replace it. Alright.